We can be put on pedestals so often as professional athletes, but when we take these jerseys off, I am a black bisexual woman in America. So everything that you are facing, I face the minute I walk out this gym. What really led me to my activism was in 2019 when we went to do a kindergarten school reading. The librarian just came to me and one of my other teammates and was like, we need your help. And she's saying this with tears in her eyes and um, telling us the stories of how three bullets had penetrated their school building in one month and their representatives weren't doing anything. At that moment, it was just utilizing our platform. We have a social justice council. Uh, we have members from each team, the Wizards and the Mystics, to be a voice for the voiceless and shed light on issues that plague our communities that desperately need help and resources and opportunities, whether it is donating money or meeting um, after school programs, uh, leading marches, um, talking about issues that are plaguing the community and how we can really just be a solution for those problems. Because at the end of the day, it's not enough to just wear DC across my chest. It still was probably the hardest decision this far in my life that I've had to make was sitting out a season. I didn't feel like I could be a champion on the court and a champion in my community by being removed from my community and not being able to be on the front lines, not being able to be at marches, not being able to sit in rooms that are having these dialogues that need to be had about decisions being made moving forward. I wanna be in those chairs. When you talk about social justice, we need equity across the board and there's enough out here to have equity across the board so that everyone thrives and that everyone has the same opportunities and resources that they need. We need normal people that understand what it means to be and live in these traumas, to now take leadership to bring solutions and bring um, truth and honesty and transparency and vulnerability. So I think I want to go into politics. I would love to be a mayor or uh, even a governor of Pennsylvania or, you know, Looking bigger picture down the line, I would love to, to hold a seat and be able to represent a community that needs true representation and someone that understands what it means to be in their shoes.